Well, ladies and gentlemen, the time has finally arrived. My Friendly Neighborhood has officially been released, and boy, oh boy, let me tell you, I am excited to play this game. Now, if you have no idea what it is, it's kind of a mix between, like, Sesame Street and Resident Evil. We played a demo of this game a while back on the channel, and it was so fun. I mean, like, so fun and so well made. And by the way, shout out to the developer of this game for giving us an early copy of it. And, uh, yeah, with that being said, let's go ahead and jump in. What is that noise? What? What is going on? Sounds like a machine. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, guys. So, just keep your eyes on me here because Stop I'm gonna actually cow. hit survival. Okay. Last job of the day. What's this one about? So, it says here a work order. Sprockets Palm Property Management. Work order request. Client. City Network Broadcasting Group. Property 123 Sunrise Street. Really close to Sesame Street. Date, July 8th, 1993. The crewman assigned, Gordon J. O'Brien. Description of the problem, it's a vacant studio lot, regained power last night, and began televising over top normal programming. The client has requested that the broadcast array on the top of the central hotel be disabled to prevent further incidents. Supervisor's signature is just J. And then note, crewman O'Brien is on probation for sullen and impolite behavior towards clients. Failure to satisfactorily complete this work order will result in termination. So I guess I am Gordon J. O'Brien, and if I don't get this job done, I'm getting fired, guys, because I'm on probation for being rude. <laughs> All right. Um. So this is my truck. Got What's that this? In the war. Last time I stick my neck out for someone. Okay, so we got this cool little emblem, heart emblem. Is it like the purple heart? And then what's oh, this? I'm not eating that. That's been there for days. Okay, that's disgusting. I thought that was like a marble bread, but I think it's mold. And we can open up our glove box. Ooh, candy bar. Oh, and we gotta leave our hazards on before we leave the car. I'm not leaving yet. I just got here. Okay, whoops, my bad. Oh, here we go. We're gonna exit the truck. So let's go ahead and get this work order complete. It should be pretty easy. Antenna. What? The antenna's Jeez, that thing the all the way up the there? Worst. Okay, well, I guess we gotta go up. Maybe go into the office and let's see if we can get some some help over here. Never mind, it's locked. So by the way, guys, this game is gonna be a little, or this video is gonna be a little under edited compared to most videos because I think it's a different vibe. You know what I mean? We're gonna make a longer gameplay. An elevator, maybe it still works. It's gonna be a lot more chill just to bring in the scary vibes. All right, well here we go. Let's go to the elevator. Uh, here we go. Oh! Is this glue? It looks like Grimace got a little heavy on the elevator. Let's keep moving. All right, let's go to the front reception Ring desk. Me. Okay. I got some manly hands. What the heck is that? What is that? A pic? Is that a little part of the? It's like the building, but miniature. What is going on? Raise the curtain. Bring up the lights. The neighborhood it's a sock puppet. is coming to town. It's the sock puppet, Ricky. Uh, hello. I'm here to disconnect the antenna. Television's heartbeat has returned. A spirit of cheer brightens every child's eye. The cry goes round the kindergarten That's cool. class. The neighborhood. The neighborhood. The neighborhood. Okay. The neighborhood. I I'm here to disconnect the antenna. I am Ricky the Sock. Your television will never be the same. We- hold on. Did you say disconnect the antenna? Uh-oh. Yes. Oh my, no, 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 no. You mustn't do that. That would be a catastrophe. It's broadcasting over the news. The news? No, no, trust me. The antenna is just fine as it is. Doesn't need any disconnecting. Tell you what, you wait here and I'll- <clears throat> Wait, that and sock uh, had no hand connected to it. I'll get, you, I'll get you some. What are you doing? What are you do? <laughs> what? 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 Oh, that wasn't pleasant. I'm gonna take a sec. That sock puppet has um, no hand connected to okay it. Okay then. All right. Well, I mean, he was kind enough to throw up a key card, so I guess we'll we'll just take that. I'm sure it'll come in handy down the line. All right. What else do we got over here that we could possibly use? Actually, I don't see anything. Let's just go up the stairs. Have a look up here. Wow, this game plays so smooth. It looks so amazing. Oh, look at this. Oh, I remember this guy. 
This is like the Ernie character, like the main character almost. Looks like something could be placed here. And then this is the girl. Looks like, okay. I think it's just gonna say, so these are all the characters, the puppets that I saw that tried to kill me in the demo. Which if you guys didn't see, I mean, let me tell you, this game is really, really cool. This area is off limits. I will right, we'll probably come back to that. That doesn't say anything, and then it's locked. But everything seems to be off limits up here. Let's have a look. Oh, what's this? Medallion. Okay. Well, I got a medallion. Let's see. Maybe I gotta do something out here. Maybe it's not... Let's have a look. Let's have a look. So, I mean, this is the entire studio, by the way, guys. It's not like just one piece hey, of... Hey, who's that? Okay, well, one of the puppets just walked by, and it's out here on the streets. So what brought that puppet to life? Because I know that's the Ernie puppet from playing the game. Anything in here we can use before I go in and follow this guy? Oh, that's what the key card's for. There we go. All right, let's go in. Okay, here we go. We're in the MFN studio. Looks like somebody was here. Let's inspect. So, television's friendly new neighbor. Review of My Friendly Neighborhood by Richard Lightsbury. This week saw a premiere of a new series on the net city network aimed at the preschool aged children, My Friendly Neighborhood. The show centers on the titular friendly neighborhood and its resident puppets, who, with the help of adults like Stevie, Richie Bromine, uh, teach viewers about a variety of subjects, including numbers, letters, and how to be a friendly neighbor. The show's catch all term for age old lessons about caring and sharing. While adult viewers may find their messages trite, children's hearts are captured by the neighbors. Each felt furball becomes a beloved friend whose words are hung onto with a trust and devotion, rarely seen in older audiences. Previously aired as Ricky and Friends as an independent public access television, the series and the creator of Al Griswold were recently signed by the City Networking Broadcasting Group and, produ and production moved to the historic City Network Hotel studio on the west side. Their move into the big leagues of broadcasting is accompanied by blah, 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 blah. the text is ineligible. So we'll go ahead and keep the note. Maybe it'll come in handy somewhere down the line. Oh, we got oh a token. Okay, and nothing in that locker. Let's keep moving. Oh, she's kind of nice looking. It's like a princess. The mysteric maze. The mystic maze. Oh, I remember this. The health of lack. So that's how you get health in this game, which we could probably use. Okay, well, we got two doors. Let's go through this one. Hello, hello! Is hey anybody? I'm Norman. Uh oh, oh. Normal guy. Is anyone there? Uh oh. Uh, show up to be a friendly face in the background. Um. Sometimes. Guys, I know they're supposed to be a. Let's like just see. Shoot. Maybe he doesn't attack me. Maybe he's friendly. Welcome, welcome. Hi. Why? I keep forgetting that they do a jump scare before they hit you. Okay, sorry. Stay back. Stay back. Stay back. Stay back. Stay back. I'm gonna go through that door. I'm gonna go through that door. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I forget that they do a jump scare, man. Oh man, this is so cool. Here we go. The big, the puppet's big heist. And. Where are we at? Okay, we're in an actor's dressing room. There oh, okay, you it's are. Ricky again. Now, don't toddle off again. I've got some snackaroo. Wait, it's Ricky! Back in the lobby. Wasn't hey, that the name what's of the. Going on here? Your puppet friends are attacking me. Oh, are they? How embarrassing. By the way, what's your name? What? Borden? Your name, your moniker, your handle, your nom de plume. It's Gordon. Gordon? What a beautiful name. I could say it all day. I would say his Gordon. name is all right. Gordon. It's not beautiful. Gordon. Is this a gun? Does it work? Uh, oh, my. Uh, that's where I left that. I'm hey, 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 hey. Oh, Let go, oh you dirty God. sock. Boy. Little rat. Blah. Blah. Fine. If you're gonna go gallivanting all over the place, then at least watch out for Pearl. Pearl? Who's Pearl? You know, the enormous bird that crushes people. Don't get on her bad side is all I <laughs> What was that? Uh-oh. Oh, no. Hey, 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 finish! What about Pearl? What about Pearl? Okay, let's do this. Okay, so he just knows that the magazine is... The letter thing. Oh no. Oh no. Wait, wait, wait. All right, I guess we're going to have to get into a little gunfight here. Back. 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 Leave me alone. 
Okay, I have one bullet left Your after alphabet, that. Huh? It's so cool. It shoots alphabet letters at them. Oh, wait. I forgot. You got to tape them. I don't have any tape, so we're out of here. Locked. Oh, and it's locked. Maybe I could find the key. What's this shape all about? Uh, I bet you we have to find a circle key to get through that door. I'm a crafty monster. Okay. <laughs> you give me a task and I'll oh, no. A There's another <laughs> puppet down here, but I don't... Bro, I don't have any more bullets. Maybe there's some on here. Uh-oh, don't turn around, please, lady. Lady, don't turn around. Let's just sneak past her. Oh, she didn't even realize. All right, let's just get out of here. Let's just go through that door. Um, another door, a triangle key. Oh, I can go through here, though. Oh, health. And more magazines. Perfect. And another note. The neighborhood is having an outdoor bazaar. Everyone is lining up at Leonard's antique display to try and on a beautiful pair of earrings. Pearl enters, sees the earrings, and cuts into the line, pushing Lilana out of the way and causing a commotion. Stevie, standing up. What? Oh, it's just like a script. That's pretty cool. So this is whoever plays maybe Lilana or Pearl. That's their dressing room. Ooh, tape in the toilet. That's, that's where I always like to keep my tape, actually. Don't you guys keep all your tape in the toilet, too? Okay, and I guess we'll just go through this door. So, oh no, another guy. Okay, should we tape him? You guys think? Let's tape him up. So by taping him, now when we leave, like let's say we go through this door and then we come back, he will be, they revive when you leave the room and come back. But since he's taped, he cannot come after us anymore. He's stuck. He's stuck there. So ideally you want to kill a puppet or like knock them out and then tape them up so they can't come back. Let's go into this door so we don't have to deal with that girl. Ooh, a save. Okay, let's save. Oh, I forget. You need tokens to save. So that's really important. We need to collect as many tokens as we... Speaking of the devil, we need to collect as many... Oh my God, more. Yes, we'll take those. And then this is... Oh, more magazines. Yeah, I'll take that. Also, this is like the storage. So if you're... If you're, if you're Inventory gets too full. You can put stuff in here and then come back for it later. Really like Resident Evil. Oh, health. Oh, I didn't need to heal, but that's cool. I don't think that was in the demo. If you get health, if you lose health, you could just come here, pay five tokens, and then get your health back. All right, she's... Oh, it's unlocked. Good, good, good. Here we go. Where's this? Wait, isn't this the room that... All right, we've already... Been this is the room that we came in. Okay, this is new. This is new. The tubular throwdown live. What is that noise? Ooh, target practice. Uh oh, uh oh. What did I do? Is it going to start at target range? Oh, and a TV. And another diamond door. Ooh. Oh, the key. The blue circle key. All right, so we got the... What is this? And a wrench. Oh, so I can save bullets now. I can just use my wrench. And now we got the blue circle key. So we got two doors that I know off bat that we need to open up, right? Is my favorite so... I always eat the, food that most the first like door would be that one that's like, um... That I thought was originally a kitchen. Which is over here, right? Oh! Oh! Wow! Okay, this thing is legit. This thing is legit. Bro, this is actually as good as the gun. Except for you gotta get a little closer, but hey... Sometimes it's nice to get some close hand combat. Watch this. Hey. Oh my gosh. All right, here's the first circle door. Ooh. Ooh, pizza. And burger. Bro, there's cookies, pizzas, burgers. Jello. Okay. And then. Oh. I gotta look around to make sure. Make sure nobody's gonna try to attack me after that. And then we got. Wait, it's tape shut. Well, can I just break it with this? Ooh, tape! All right, that's good. And then nothing in that one. It sounds like a chainsaw or something is rattling up in here. I'm a craft oh. monster. Oh, I'm just above this girl <laughs> now. So, what's so important up myself. here? All right, this is the door I was looking for. It unlocked with the blue circle key. All right, where's this gonna lead us? Let's find out. Oh! This must be one of the old sets. That's so cool. So this is like... It's like... Bootleg Sesame Street! Literally! Look! We're on the street! The coin laundry, the pizza place, 
The back alleys? All right. Let's go over here first. Let's lock from the other side. All right, we're going to have to find a way in there. So they open. All right, so we can go in here at least. What's this? Oh, we need a square key to get in there. Avion alphabet with Pearl. Oh, no. Is Pearl around here? I'm so scared to run into her. What's this? Oh, it's Pearl! Wow, she looks like a dragon. So she's like the big bird of this game. Oh, that's crazy. I wonder if I can just get above him and drop in. What is this? Inspect. Okay, press it. Oh, it opens up this door. Okay, that's good. So now we need to just get in there. Okay, so whatever we need is probably behind that door. Maybe that's where the square key is. So is per Pearl might be like an instant... Uh-oh. Uh, I'm just going to walk this way. Pretend that I didn't see that. Oh, look. Here we go. This is how we drop in. I'm going to use the gun while we... Because until we run out of bullets, we're going to use this gun. How many bullets? He's still up. Oh my gosh, that guy just wasted so many of my bullets. All right, either way, let's see what's back here. Oh, the key. Yep, we got the key and some more magazines. So, what door was it? Oh, it's here. This is how we get into this cash register. Let's go ahead and pop this puppy open. A letter block, X, and two coins. All right, that letter block has to be important. I just don't know. I don't know for what reason, though. All right, let's keep moving. Can we go in here? Okay, what's that? Oh, more magazines. We'll take that. Anything else in here? Nope. On to the next shop. The pizza place. It's nailed shut? And okay, what's this? Oh, inspect. Interesting. So you can change. That has to be a puzzle or something. We're going to have to figure that out. Go to the back of the pizza shop. Took me to a back alley. Okay, okay, okay. Whoa, whoa. Okay, you're. This guy has so much health, bro. That guy takes so many bullets. Inspect. What was that? What did that say? Shells. Oh right, because we get a shotgun in this game eventually. I remember that from the demo. Let's go to the other alley, which was to the left when we get out of the pizza place. Yeah, over there. Let's check that out. That's I hear the bird. Oh, there she is. Oh my gosh, she's huge, dude. And they said that she'll stomp me to death? Is that what Ricky said? Oh, it's this guy again. Norman, die! Norman, die! Norman, die. Normal Norman. Oh, another letter block. So we got an X and a C now. What is this for? The letter box. I haven't seen anything that I would put this on. Right, let's go up. Uh-oh. Don't fall. <laughs> I feel like that's pretty obvious advice, but hey. Oh. Magazine. Free magazine. I'll take that. A mushroom. Looks like it can open, but the lid won't lift. Oh, it's probably with that little... I bet you... I bet you whatever I have it left on opens up that box, and then the mushroom will open that one. Okay, okay. Oh, wow, look at this. Oh, the bird. The bird is like Roxanne Wolf. She's obsessed with herself. She looks at herself in the mirror. Oh, that guy's got no health at all, so that's really good. Oh, we can go this way, too. Oh, a square door. We have the key for this. Let's have a look. What the heck? Okay, guys, listen. Listen. I'm just going to go ahead and make a point. Norman shouldn't have done it, bro. You're too young for this, Norman. I'm just go ahead and drain this and take... Oh, wait a second. Why'd you just... Why'd you... Why do you do it? Why are you shaking like that, Norman? Why are you shaking like that, Norman? I just want the block. I, just... oh! I knew it. I knew it. Wait. Stupid this. puppet. Oh, wait. You're not going to attack me? All right. Well, I'm going to look around a little bit more. Holy, what was he doing in there? He was taking a bath with his clothes on? All right, let's keep moving, though. Let's keep moving. Where am I? Oh, and then the sardines open up that box. Interesting. Here we go. Oh, look, another letter block, a P. A P? P-A-X-C? 
tape. Good. We'll take that. It's so funny how these puppets just talk. They're constantly talking, dude. Also, might as well change that to one of these so we can open that up when we walk by it again. So we're at like the city hall. I walked through the middle door in the middle of the complex here. I still need that diamond. There's somebody in there, but I need that diamond key still. All right, here we go. What's in here? A note. Oh no, it's a token. There's letter blocks up here. Oh, maybe I got to put the letter block somewhere in here. Oh no, another letter block. S. Interesting. Oh, I don't really understand the concept of these letter blocks. All right, I guess we came in through that door, right? Let's go upstairs. Hopefully the letter blocks go somewhere up here. Okay. Oh, look. Thank God we can save again. Go ahead and hit a quick save. Heal up. Really good. Okay, perfect. And then we've got a place to put our tools. Some tape and some tokens. But nowhere to put these letter blocks. Okay, so as I was... Oh my God. Settle down, big bird. Oh, let me get behind this. Actually, we could do this from behind. All right, so I can put letters here. How many letters do I need? Okay, I need two more. So they've got to be around here somewhere. This is nailed shut, so I can't go in there. Oh, they might be in these. Oh, that would be... That would be pretty trash if they were. All right, so we got it switched to the mushroom, which was above me here. I doubt there's one here because we just found this one. I was on the oh my God, it's the bird. Okay, okay, listen. Good birdie. Good birdie. I'm just going to back up and I'll go the other way. Don't worry. All right, where was the olive one again? I think it was upstairs, right? Oh, no. Oh, look, another letter. All right, so yeah, we got to do that. I think we got to open up the onion one and then we'll open up the sargine one. This guy's just talking to himself. These, these puppets are crazy. They were teaching kids. Teaching kids what? Had to be lunatics? All right, let's go ahead and put our next letter down. Do I have to move these at all? Oh, no, we probably have to just... What? What the? Okay, whatever. We'll figure out that later. But first, let's go here. Let's put this on sardine because we know where that that box is. And I haven't seen the... There's a... Pizza and an onion. One. Oh no, the onion one. Let's do the onion. The onion's right above. Go go here. Onion. I hear the bird. I hear the bird, but I don't see the bird. Hopefully, it's not back here. Please, Pearl. Oh no, you're there, Pearl. Settle down, lady. Settle down. All right, we made it past Pearl. Thank God. All right, what do we got here? It is. Wait. I've already opened this one. Yeah, that was the f okay. So that was the first one that we had. Run past Pearl, please, Pearl. Don't don't kill me, Pearl. Don't kill me. All right. So what did we leave it on? Onion, and we've already done onion. So I guess we will switch this to mushroom. Oh my God, bro. Oh, hell. I haven't come down here before. Ah! Thank God. All right. So we found the last letter. M, 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 M. Ooh, M magazines. Bro, this is the this room rocks. <laughs> all right, let's get out of here. Um, so all we got to do is go back to the main area, which is right down there. I hear the bird, but I think we can avoid her if we go back this way. We might have to fight a puppet here. You know, I really realized that this Resident Evil wouldn't... This is literally Resident Evil vibes. It's just more colorful. And instead of zombies, it's puppets. So it makes it less scary. But just imagine, this is literally Resident Evil. And I had to tie these guys up, by the way, because they were just... They were a little too active right here. All right, so we got to figure out what this word is. Oh, neighbor. Neighbor. How do you spell it again? It's N-E... Okay. Oh, neighbor. Yeah, I knew that. Okay. Oh, I got I got mail. I got mail. I got mail. I got mail. Please don't kill me, bird. Let's just go put this in the mail. Here we go. What? Crank. Okay. Maybe this unlocks a different part of the studio. Okay. What did I... What did I see a crank before? A secret entrance. Shush. Check. Oh! Okay, this is... Okay, perfect. We got it. We got it. We got it. There we go. So where does this unlock? The sewer? Oh! Wait, 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 wait! This is the demo! This is part is from the demo. Getting back up that way. Yeah, this is the demo. Okay, I figured it out. Alright, this is cool. This is really cool. 
So Ray, Ricky, Ricky should be popping up here somewhere. Ray is the giant thing. He's like a giant monster that hangs out in the sewer and he's like a one shot kill. There's oh Ricky. Oh dear, oh my. You seem to be stranded in the basement. Yes, How I am. I get out of here, Ricky. Oh, having a clue. Never come down here myself. Why? What's got your overalls in a knot? I'm trying to get to the roof. The roof? <laughs> What's so interesting about the roof? He really doesn't want down me to turn off this uh, more antenna. Intriguingly musty. Unrelated. How do you feel about blunt force head trauma? Oh, boy. What is it this time? Well, Ray, of course. He's the best sort of monster janitor thing. But he's a little obsessed with uh, organic maintenance. Tends to pop out of pipes and clobber people with his wrench. Great. Are all of you puppets crazy? Well, Ray has always <laughs> been a little grouchy, even before the shutdown. That's why they moved him down here. Only way out is by elevator, and he can't figure out how to use the buttons. Elevator. Got it. Oh, silly me. I forgot about the elevators. Really, Gordon, I wouldn't bother. The cables are probably rusted. I don't think they even run anymore. I'll take my chances. Okay, wow, Ricky so really stuff. doesn't Look, want us to go. get out of here. Wash my hair. He is an evil sock puppet. But he's kind of dumb, too, because he gives us... He literally gives us all the information that we need every time we see him. So the war is over. After 20 years of fighting, the city government has finally declared a complete withdrawal of troops from the northern continent called the War of Horrors. The conflict, which mainly involved guerrilla confrontations in the rainforest, resulted in almost 100,000 casualties. Unlike previous homecomings, veterans returning to the city, main docks were booed and hissed, reflecting the negative attitude of many adults for those who volunteered and served the war. Uh, hoping to protect their homes, but in the eyes of the public, helping to perpetrate those horrors. The Northern War has also been called the first war fought in the living room, due to the televised news reels that kept civilians at home up to date with events overseas. Oh, wow. So it looks really bad on us, and in, especially me, because our character fought in the war. So he probably came back and didn't get received the best way. But I'm down here in the sewers now. I'm in the trenches, ladies and gentlemen. What are we gonna find down here? I'm not 100% sure, but the first thing that we need to look for is the elevator. Oh, I gotta take out my gun. I don't know why he put it away. Got some good bullets here. Also, I'm gonna take this. Yeah, I'm gonna use it. We're gonna use it. That should bring us to full health. I need to find a place to save, but I don't wanna risk it in the meantime. All right, just walk past this. Oh my God! What are you doing behind me? Come on, there's a door here. Oh, it's locked. Come on. Come on. No. Oh, that was close. All right. So we can't go through there. We're going to need a key to get through there. I'm going to tape you up because I'm sure we're going to have to come back. And I'm looking for magazines and some more health. So first things first, we need to really figure out this area. So Puppets Pirate. Pirate's Cove. A, tri a triumph for the family by Richard Lightsbury. As my friendly neighborhood franchise grows, it was inevitable. Inevitable. For okay. Boring. Continued on episode four. Whatever. Doesn't really go towards what we need to do, I don't think. All right, so by the way, guys, this right here is the janitor that they're talking about. I forget his name already. Uh, it's something with an R. They literally just said it back there, but I've already forgotten. But yeah, we got to watch out for him. Because he pops up in like little sewer things like this. And he can just smack you on the head. And I think it's an insta-kill. What was that? Oh, wait, that's... F no, 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 no. I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! I gotta get out of here. So they're not alive yet, but when we come back into this room, all those puppets will be alive. All right, so I got something for one of the doors. I don't remember what, but I remember that in the kit. Not again, not again. Oh, you're just laughing on the floor. We're gonna sneak past you. There's nothing in here that we need yet. All right, let's go this way. So this little keyboard typewriter thing goes to like, I kind of remember it's like an area where you you set it down and then all the puppets start spawning and coming after you all right let's inspect this all right tape magazines anything here no all right keep it moving oh baby wait there's no room in the toolbox oh man we gotta we gotta maybe move some stuff around oh everything's pretty organized i gotta maybe use something let's see can we use any of this I don't know why I even have these glasses, but I feel like they're going to come in handy, so... Alright. Oh, wait. No, I can use the health. Let's see. Maybe if I use the health... Use... Confirm. 
move that up here. Mm, no, that's still not going to really work. Unless I tape one of these puppies down. What is it? Oh, more magazines. Oh, I can just reload. Right? Let's see. Did that move it? No. Okay. Well, that kind of stinks. All right. Well, let's maybe tape up a puppet and then we'll come back. Because we need that shotgun, bro. I need that shotgun. That's something I need in my life. Oh, wait. I'm getting a lot of stuff here. We're going to actually have to deposit this. Oh, yeah. Look at all this. All right. We'll come back for you, shoddy. I promise, shoddy. We'll be back. Um, Where did we come from? That door or this door? I don't remember. Have a look. I'll know as soon as I walk through here. Alright, yeah, we came through here. So we'll walk through the other side. So the shotgun is in that room. We cannot forget that. Okay? We're definitely going to need to come back and get it. Because, let me tell you guys, this game is only going to get harder from here. Boss battles, crazy things that are still to come. So, walk past this dude. Honestly, I should probably tie him up. Because eventually we're going to have to jump off. And he's going to be waiting for us. So... Either way, I mean, I guess we can shoot him from the top. Save us the tape. All right, what's that noise? Oh, no. Oh, no. There's a, there's a puppet in that corner. Okay, so I haven't seen this guy yet. He will... You'll see his fat head, though. I'm telling you guys, we're not going to leave this level without seeing him. He's kind of like the bird of the last stage. Okay, nothing here that we can take. Not there. Welcome! Welcome! I'm... So this is like the first puppet that you see in the demo. Got him. All right, good. Keep it moving. Oh my God. All right, she doesn't see us yet, so I'm not even gonna mess with her. Nice, more magazines. Look at the rat, it's so cute. It's a puppet rat. Okay, we're gonna keep going this way. Still no signs of whatever his name is. Rupert, that's not his name. Okay, this is a, okay, you get, I remember this from the demo as well. You have to remember something up here and then go down. No? Nope. All right. Either way, we got to we gotta deposit some stuff in here. So, um, I think it's good that we keep the keys. I don't really know what the medallion is for. We're going to stash that because we don't need it right now at this very moment. Uh, we're going to stash the glasses because we don't know what that's for. The shotgun shells, we need them. I'm just going to move them up here. Move that here. Actually, we can stash the tokens because we literally only need the tokens when we are near the token thing. Um, tape we'll keep up here in this corner. Shotgun we'll keep. Uh, we'll stash the chocolate because I don't even know what it's for, to be honest. Um, keep that there. Keys, I think, are good to keep on us. And then move this. Oh, man. Um, we can move that there. So does that give me enough space? No, I think we need to stash the wrench. All right, that's good. Um, let's save. So we don't need to heal. Save our tokens for that. And there we go, baby. We've done it. Okay, so here we go. This is what I was talking about. So down here, you can see there's going to be different. It's square plus two, triangle minus one, and circle plus six. Okay. And then there's something here as well. Oh, that's the map. Oh, good. So we finally got a freaking map. All right, that's amazing. So square plus two, triangle minus one, and circle plus six. Let's go down and have a look at this. Because that is what, um, that's what we're going to use to get out of here. Oh, and some health. And then that's locked. But not for long. We're, we're going to figure out that key as well. So here we go. Okay, square, oh, triangle. Looks like it needs power. Okay. And then we need something for here. Inspect. Forget what this is for. Okay, hold on. Let's have a look. Oh, look. I have this thing. This plug seems incomplete. But I have it. Don't I? Did I put it away? Hold on. Let me have a look. Metal piece. Move. Look, that's the piece, no? I guess not. Okay. That's weird. All right, maybe we don't have everything we need for this just yet. So we'll come back. But I was almost certain that that's what that thing is for. All right, let's go past this girl. Maybe we'll get our answers we're, past her. We're in the alphabet. What's the alphabet? Oh, oh my God, it's getting close. Getting a little too close for comfort. We're going to tape you up and keep moving. All right, I got 45 bullets, which is pretty good. All right, nobody over here. I think this is the auditorium where we first run into not Ricky, but whatever the heck the other guy's name is. What is that? 
What is happening? Am I getting hit? Hey! Who's there? Oh yeah, here he is. He's in here. I remember this. He's he's right there on the thing. Yep, there he goes. He ran away. Look how big he is, right? He's crazy. How was that? Okay, here we go. Yep. So this is where we plug this thing in. Boy, do I have just a thing for you. <laughs> Alright, we got it. It was incomplete. That's what it was. Shoot. Okay, here comes the puppets. Alright. We're gonna have to kill them. Or whatever. You know what I mean. We're gonna have to hit them with our alphabet gun thing. Okay, no, it's only one. Actually. Oh no! It's oh my god! Yep, 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 yep. I remember this. You hit him. I should have just not hit him. Get out of the way! Get out of the way! Run, run, run! Oh my gosh, I forgot that you don't hit him. This is why you need the shotgun, by the way, guys. This right here is why you need the shotgun. No! No, 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 don't kill me. Don't kill me, please. Don't kill me. Run, 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 run. What the heck? What the heck? Hey, okay, let's go ahead and throw this bad boy up here. That should get the power going here. And then I think maybe this generates like... What? what? Okay. Due to all per to all personnel, due to the construction of the new stages, this blast door has been locked using a punch card combination. Please insert the appropriate punch card into the three terminals to open the door. In the event that you have lost your punch cards, this machine can be used to print replacements. Okay, so... What do we need to do exactly? Oh, here's the punch cards. Okay, so this is gonna have a clock on it. Each one has a different, oh, it's all the same number though. Okay, something's off here. So that's X'd out three, X. And then this one has a circle on the, that doesn't move anything though. Dude, I forgot how to do this. Let's see. Okay. Let's go back up here. Maybe. Oh, okay. That's what it is. Probably got, we got to put it in a certain order. So it says here plus two plus six. So it's circle. It's probably circle, square, triangle. Let's try that circle, square, triangle, or yeah, it's gotta be circles, circle, square, triangle. Let's try it. Hopefully that works. Cause if not, I'm completely lost. So circle, square, triangle. There we go. We got our punch card now. Um, now what do I do with this? Put it. Oh my God! I shot the gun. It scared me. All right. Insert the card. What? I don't get it. What? Wait. So circle, square, triangle, punch card. I mean, can I look at it? Okay, I don't really understand. Can I just put in any of them? Oh, okay. We get we just get this. We go here. I see. There we go. Done. So that should be it, right? That's what we need to do. And then oh, we need this one to end up on three. Okay, okay, I get it now. I get it. You have to do it in, in that oh okay, yeah, that makes sense. So in order for that one to go three we only need to go three spaces so we could get it to go um two two minus one and that will give that one and then to get it to go to x would be six and then six which would put it all the way around the clock and then no because that would be six six all the way around the clock would be 12 and then minus one would only bring it there now we need it to go plus two. So plus two plus two six. Okay, yep, I got it. So the that one in the middle is gonna be square square circle, and then that one is gonna be um what? 
<laughs> square, square, circle. And then the next one is going to be square, square, triangle. Square, square, circle, square, square, triangle. I think. I hope. Let's try it out. Let's try it out. I mean, it, it doesn't hurt to try it. So we got square, square, triangle. I don't remember which one this one is, but let's go ahead and take that. Oh, whoops. Okay, here we go. Okay, come back one. There we go. All right, so we got that one. And then square, square. Square was plus two. So square, circle. That's eight. Square would be two. I think. I think this is right. Let's try it out. Put it there. Go ahead. And then it needs to go one, two. There we go. Perfect. So we did it. All right. That opened up this door. Nice. I need to go back and get that shotgun, but... I mean, we're advancing, wow. so. I wonder how deep this goes. This is so crazy that this would be underneath a studio? A whole underground cavern? This kind of reminds me of Squid Games. Okay, let's go in. All right. Okay. Let's try to avoid these. No, because I think this is a heavily trafficked area. We should probably kill them. Actually, no, I can avoid them. I can avoid them. Right here. I just need to go into the square room. Thank God we kept the keys on us, guys. Because if not, we would have been out of luck. What's that noise? What is that? I don't know what that noise is. I need a key for this. What the heck is that? Keep out warning. Okay, well. You know how horror games work. We don't listen. Okay, so I can't go that way. Heck. Right, he's not there, so let's keep moving. Hello? Is anybody here? Okay, guess we're good. Aha! Alright, so we can go ahead and heal. Let's go ahead and do that first. And then, we'll save. Perfect. All right, um, we got a note here. Letter to the editor. As the mother of a four-year-old who is devoted to my friendly neighborhood, I'm frightened by the ton of morals on the show. The tone of morals on the show. Just yesterday, one of the characters said, you should always think of the others before yourself, even when it's uncomfortable. Whoa. But what if somebody takes advantage of you for doing that? What if doing that's uncomfortable ends up exposing you or hurt to hurt or in danger? Is it really a good idea to teach children to be so reckless with their well-being? I want my daughter to live the fullest life she can. So I don't want some TV producer filling her head with dangerous, self-sabotaging ideas. I think from now on, she'll watch something else. Probably a good idea, lady. Uh, what do we got in here? We got a magazine. That's it. That whole thing? You only get one magazine? Nothing in here. Nothing in here. Nothing in there. And nothing in there. All right, let's use the tool thing again because we need enough room. No, we still got enough room for our shotgun. Let's keep moving. Let's keep it pushing then. Oh triangle key i still need this triangle key and what else is in here before we leave oh some tape uh our magazines i mean a locked box this might actually lead me to that room where you jump down oh no what is this where the heck okay i just want to avoid her i don't really want to use my gun i'm just gonna run oh no we're gonna have to kill her Back, back, please, no, no, the other guy got me, man. All right, run past him, just run past him. All right, which way, we came in this way, so. At this point, everyone's gonna be chasing me. Just run, just run, just run. Okay, really, you guys were smart enough to cut me off? Run, run, run! <laughs> They're all chasing me now. Okay, we can get through this door with, right? Oh, please don't be locked. It's locked! Oh, thank God. There's no power. Oh, that's the elevator. Okay. Well, at least now we know where the elevator is. Okay. Stop moving. Stop moving. I'm taping you guys up. You guys need to be ta Oh, man. I can only take one. Okay. So we know where the elevator is at, which is good. There's another square door here, but I'm pretty sure this is the door we came through. Let's take a look. Um. Yes. Oh, we didn't check... Yeah, so this is the square door that we were already through. Let's go to the other one. Okay, he's back up. Dang it. Okay, where is it? There it is. Right, so let's go down here. 
What, what the heck are you doing in there, buddy? You see this guy? He's stuck in the wall. Alright, let's go in here. So weird. Oh, this is where we came from, right? Okay, so we don't go this way. So where can we use to power up the elevator? It doesn't really explain well. Oh, God. Okay, can't go that way. There's the elevator. So, and then we don't want to fall down there. Alright, we gotta go that way. But I gotta get past this fella here. Alright, there he goes. Oh, he's coming, he's coming. We gotta go. We gotta go here and then back up. Oh, wait. No, that just leads me to the... Bro, there's so much stuff in this game. It's it's really confusing. Oh, the map. All right, guys. So I, you know what's funny? I actually had to rewatch my demo gameplay to realize that there should be a key over here that I might have missed. All right, where? Ah, oh, there it is. All right, so to everyone, someone keeps taking the breakers that you use to open these doors. So I put them in these lock boxes or boxes around the basement. Here's a map of where they are in case you need to get through. Uh, Janet or Hank, it's Ray. Okay, Ray, oh, Ray is the one taking them. All right, so we got that. It has been added to your map. Perfect. So, to make things even better, I think, oops, I think if we use the map, it'll show us, yep, so all these X's are where the lock boxes are, right? Um, and we should be here. So we just gotta go up and around, and there's a lock box here. We go back through the corridor, there's another lock box here. We'll take the boat, hit the lock box that was back over here okay i think we've got a solid plan and then we've got to bring all of them back to this generator and that should allow us to leave well at least get the of course it doesn't work there but it should allow us to get through the uh elevator all right so there's a little note here as well i know that signifies like how we need to put them in the generator slots but we'll get to that in a second so let's go ahead and go back out here and okay new puppets spawn in all right well, i got a better idea here instead of going that way let's go back out here and we'll just take the boat we'll just take the boat out bro i'm not trying to even deal with these guys let's go right through here and we're taking the boat out when you go to the park oh no okay no no this guy's always here so let me just take a look at the map again we gotta look at our map so we're gonna be walking into this area you we should just go here's the elevator right and that's not working so we're gonna go out and then to the left i got 26 bullets in the clip right now and four in the no 26 in the chamber four in the clip however that works okay, thank god he's not there right now we're gonna go up into the left through that door and that should bring us to another breaker uh oh she saw us we gotta cut her off here we gotta get to the door before she does Okay, I saw her hand come out at the last second. All right, so we got a breaker in here. Let's find that one. Where is this little puppy? Oh, here we go. This is two fuses right here off the bat. Boom. And then if we go through here, I think this is the boat, right? There's not another breaker in here. No, let's go through the boat. Yep, perfect. So we'll take the boat. We'll head back over to the beginning where we got the shotgun, which by the way, guys, I do have the shotgun now. Um, and then we'll get that breaker that's over there. That'll be three. And I don't know how many we need in total. Let me have a look at the map here. We got one and two that we still need to get. And then we got these two already. I think we just need four in total. But we'll just grab these now. All right. So I think if we open this right across the hallway should be. Where's it? This. This should bring us back to the. Okay. So this is the shotgun room. Is that where we need to go? We need to go... I feel like there's a breaker here. Maybe I'm just remembering wrong. Okay. We're gonna ignore him. We already tied up the other girl here. No need to worry about her. This could be the exit. I just want to double check, because if not, we gotta go back. Uh... Maybe not. Let me look. Is there a breaker here? Where are we? Okay, so we can go out and around, but we should go back... And, okay, let's go get this one first, and then we'll come back for that one. Okay, so we're back in this area. I'm just going to tape him up because I got that extra tape. 
There we go. We've got the third breaker. And now let's just go get that last and final breaker. And we'll make it back to the, uh, the breaker box. Start the elevator and hopefully get the heck out of here. But we all know it's not going to be that easy. Back through this door we go. This should bring us back into the main lobby. And then... Um, it should be very simple after that, right? I mean, how far is it from here? Gotta look at the map. Uh-oh. Wait. He's right. Ray is right next to me. We're gonna go here, around... Okay, I know where it is. It's where, um... Yeah, there's Ray. It's where we did the puzzle. The first initial puzzle. Don't move, Ray. Stay right there, buddy. Don't even think about going around. Move, uh, Ray. Okay. We tied up. Good thing we tied them up. I knew that was gonna... From the demo, I knew they were gonna be an issue. So I'm glad we just... We took care of that from the beginning. It's probably best that we just get, use our tape while we have it. You know what I mean? So we're in here now. There's the breaker box. Boom. So now I think we have all of them. I'll we'll just go back through the door. Head over to the breaker room. Which shouldn't be too far from this giant rocky hallway. Okay. No, no more puppets in here, which is good. I keep wanting to call them animatronics since we've been so, playing so many Five Nights at Freddy's games. All right. Um, all right. Let's go this way. Wait. Hold on. She's running this way. I actually don't think... Uh, let's reset her. Let's reset her. Because if I go through there and get jump scared, I'm going to be really sad. So it's best we just restart that. Okay. I know where it is now. I just remembered. So it's down here and then up this hallway. Yep. Okay, I remember. No, no, no. Stay, stay over there! Stay over there! Leave me alone! No! Oh my god, he's right behind me. Get in there, get in there. I'm trying to save as many bullets as I can. I'm literally playing this Resident Evil style. Wait, did I not open this one? Okay, we already did. So that was the first one we did. Okay, here we go. Perfect. So let's go to the breaker box, which is right here. And then U and E. All right, so we can put them all here, and then we're going to have to move them around. But in order to know what how we're going to do that, I got to open up the... I don't remember. How do I check? How do I check, like, my inventory? I don't remember what button it is. Because we need to check... Okay, it's not that. We need to check where exactly all the breakers and stuff go. Uh, I don't know what button it is. It's not this. Oh, no. Would it be here? Left mouse button for the menu? No. I need to get to where my notes are. No. Because that would tell me which breakers go in what position. Or, I guess I could just rewatch my video. Okay, if the game is anything, there we go. If it's anything like the demo, which thankfully it was, that is the solution to our problem. So here we go. We have made it into this little vault. It's locked with a chain. I guess we can't go there. Bro, this guy's obsessed with himself. Oh, here we go. Perfect. So the cutters. Oh, is that how you turn around quick? You hit Q? Yeah, that's good to know. Let's take all this. Let's take this. Oh, I got new shotgun ammo. Go ahead and reload this puppy. And uh, yeah, let's get to moving. So we can clip these now. That's cool. Oh, okay. So this brings me here. And there was another door back at the beginning. I remember that. And we got a clip. I don't know what it's going to do for us, but let's find out, I guess. So, this is cool. All right, we're finally starting to understand what we're doing here. What else needed to be clipped, bro? I'm trying to remember. Oh, yeah. Okay, so there was a door over here. In order to get to it, we're going to have to hit Ray. See ya. All right, so Ray's gone. Let's go up here. Let's clip this door. See what's in there. Oh, 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 oh. Oh! Oh! He's, he's gone. Remember there was a puppet here in the corner? All right, well, I'm not going to shoot him with this. We're going to shoot him with the actual little pistol. Wait, here it is. Can I just... Can I just hit... Oh, I don't have my thing. This guy takes so many bullets! Hello! Do I have tape? I need to tape... Oh, man. I need to tape that guy. He takes so many shots. Okay, uh, so we're back over here. 
Where's the thing that needed to be cut with the... Gotta be over here. Also, great move tying her up. She would have been super annoying, too. Oh, here we go. This one. Boom. We'll unlock that. I don't know what... Okay. Where does this go? Underneath? Oh, secret tape. A cheat unlocked. What does that mean? What kind of cheat got unlocked? This must be the elevator Ricky was talking about. Here we go. Oh, this is perfect. And wait, we should have power to it now, right? Oh my god, we can leave finally. Holy, this is great. That was way easier than I thought. Okay, we're out. We're out of the sewer. I think. Did that work? Oh, yes. We're back upstairs. Oh, okay, awesome. Um, I can't go through there. This is locked. We're back upstairs. Oh, man, thank God. Another triangle thing? Oh, and that goes to the music studio. Great. It's starting again. Oh, look, see? So this is a problem. This is why we're here. Because for whatever reason, there's some radio trans... Well, I guess television transmissions that are coming over, like, the news stations and playing shows from this studio here my friendly neighborhood studio and we got to shut down the antenna to make sure that that stops wait this is different oh my gosh they're giving us a lot of ammo here uh oh why did that activate i'm kind of scared that i might have just activated something all right let's do it all at once here like you know we got to keep track of what we're doing and what we're not doing so let's go through this door and then we'll come across and we'll go through the other door Oh my gosh, there are so many puppets in here. There's so many, bro. What is this? Can I walk past you? Ah! Oh man, that's gonna hurt. Ah! No! 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 How many bullets? That's a lot of bullets! Okay, so you can't walk past those puppets. <laughs> They're kind of cute, though. They're just evil. Which, I guess that's the point of this game. All right, here we go. Another, thank God. I don't have any tokens to heal. Or save? Oh, I do, I do, I do, I do. I remember. I put them all in the, okay. Poof. That scared me for a second, bro. And a velvet mask. Wait, can I just put this on? If I put the velvet mask on, wouldn't it? I have glasses and a velvet mask. Why can't I wear those? I probably should have healed first, but whatever. Let's rearrange this, right? So, um, I'm going to leave those because we might need them. I'll leave the tape. We'll leave the shells. I don't think we're going to need these keys, but it's probably best to keep them on us. We'll stash that because I haven't used it yet. I don't even know what the chocolate bar does, so we'll stash that as well. Um, the health would come in handy, and the magazines would come in handy, and so would the tape, right? So, let's move that here move that here move that here we'll keep this over there with this boom this i think we're gonna need so i'm gonna leave it there the mask though couldn't see how the mask would be important to us but just in case we'll hold on to it all right and then what we should do with this extra space is we're gonna take some of our tokens wait i only have one five Oh no, that's really bad. Okay, well, I need it. So, take. Oh my god, dude. I thought I had so many more tokens. Alright, well, maybe we should save it and not use it on the health. In case we need to save or something. Alright, well, that's this is bad. This is really bad. Um, so, wait a second. I risked all of that just to come over here. Oh, cool. Did you see me? No, he didn't see me yet. You're too close. Oh, no, I didn't. Okay, hold on. I think we can do this if we just run here. Shot him. All right, good. Run. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Okay. Got to save as much ammo as we possibly can because these puppets are crazy. Oh, cross, bro. This is crazy, dude. There's so much to do. Okay. I'm in here. What's this say? Uh... On the war, a reflection. Last month marked seven years since the end of the war, so it seems like a good time to reflect on the impact it has on, on our lives. I think across the whole city, the war has left us feeling troubled. We are called to service for the sake of righteousness, love for one city, and protecting others. 
But in the end, we found that all those calls were just noble lies. And behind them, the horror of reality thwarted our starry, our starry-eyed ideals. We left home as heroes, came home as murderers. But this tension leads to a question. Why should we care about the right and wrong or friendliness as the children have put it? Oh, following such things can be a terrible cost. The only reason would be if they're... Okay, this... All right, basically, what I'm getting from this is, again, the war wasn't good. People don't like it. And they hate the people who did it. Which, kind of me in a sense. All right, uh, another elevator. It's not working. All right, so I guess we got to get this elevator up and running. In the meantime, keep doing some exploring. So... We got save on that side, elevator on that side. I haven't been over here. Can I leave without it? Oh, I can't. No, nope, I can't. Of course it is. Ricky. Ricky's locked us in, it looks like. And so where did we come in? Right underneath this, All right? So let's go upstairs. We haven't looked around up here yet. This is like a movie theater. Go in here. Oh, I don't like the look of this. I do not like the look of this. Grenade? Okay, you know all these puppets are about to come alive, right? You guys know it. But look at all these tokens. This is good. That's locked. Who's this giant frog? Oh, is that another grenade? Nope, that's just a can. I thought it was a grenade. Okay. Come down here. More tokens? No. No. Oh, there's a token, right? No, these are all poker chips. All right, let's go over here to the... Oh, the mask. There's no room in the toolbox. Size is four. Okay, can I clear up some room here? Let's see. Um. Well, I don't want to throw anything away. But I'm assuming we're going to need that mask as well. Okay, let's look around, though. We'll come back to that. Because I think we're going to need that mask. I could take the health, and that would give me enough space. Yeah, let's do that. We'll do that, save ourselves the health, and then I'll throw the grenade probably when we pick up this mask. I'll take the health, we'll use that, confirm. And then we got to what, rearrange this a little bit to make space for the mask, which could go right there. All right, perfect. Let's go over here, grab the mask, and I think that's gonna activate all these puppets, and it did. You're gonna ambush me, huh? Take that! Okay, that was cool. That kind of worked for this half of them. Take out our gun. And run. And run. And run. I can't go through there because that, that was locked, right? What about this? Oh, that was open. What? Magazine! No! Ah! Unhand me! Unhand me, you puppet rat! Get out, get out, get out, get out! Okay. So we got two masks. I'm assuming we got to put them somewhere. That's got to be important. Let's keep moving. Let's keep moving. Oh, boy. Okay, this is getting out of hand, right? Go through here. <laughs> um. No, I keep looking for, like, tokens. We're finding a lot of bullets. A lot of tokens right now. Check these desks as well. Nothing. Nothing? This big empty, empty desk really had nothing in it. Wow, there's so many spots for there to be... Uh-oh. Oh, this is getting kind of scary now. I gotta kill him because I gotta go on that side. Hey, hey! Stop! Stop! They're taking too many bullets now, guys. What the heck? That's that creature that we saw that was golden. Can't go through there. I need, I need that triangle and I need that diamond key. Keep my, oh, he saw me. All right. I'm going to tie this one up because we're going to have to come back through this way and I don't want to waste the bullets. My God. Tape him. Okay, we taped him to the door. I should probably tape the other one too because I think we're going to have to come through this hallway a couple times. So save the bullets, use the tape, and uh, let's cut through. Okay, we can't go through that door still. But we can go through this one and the door that he's taped to. Okay, let's inspect. Got more tape. Good. Nothing in there. Nothing over here. Nothing there. You can inspect these, right? Okay, magazines. And that's about it over there. Uh, on this one. 
Ooh, shotgun shells. Wait, is there a token there? Perfect. All right. Interesting. Not a lot going on in there, but we'll take it. And I still have no sense of direction as to where we're going for us to take to the door. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay, um, here we go. He's looking the other way, so we should be okay to kind of explore without getting attacked. Okay. I can see outside. It's dark now. Unless that's just a studio. Let's go upstairs. Sure, we're going to have to pass her eventually, but for now, let's go up here. What is this? Oh my gosh, man. You're kidding me? I need that for everything. Hopefully, we find that over here. There we go. All right. She was easy to handle. I'll tape her up so we can... Ah, she was only two bullets. So I probably... What? He's bigger, right? Does he look bigger than the other ones? Okay, let's go through here. Hopefully he doesn't come alive when we come back out. Oh, boy. Stop moving at me. I don't have any more tape, so you're just going to have to kind of sit there for a second. Can I look through any of this? No. Oh. What about oh, this? This, surely. There we go. Okay. Oh, boy. Thank God these are easy to kill. A little three, one bullet each. They're going to show back up. That's the only problem. All right, so we can ring this. It might bring Ricky. Can we do it? It looks like target practice. All right, might as well. Go ahead and ring it. Okay. Got it. I did it. So now what do I do? What does that do? Oh, it leads to something. Let's see. Back here. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, wow. Look at that. More health. I can't even take it, though. Actually, let's take one. And then we'll replace it with another one. And then, I mean, I guess we can always come back for that one. Inspect. Oh. Looks like something is missing. Okay, so we're going to need some type of blocks to get that open. Oops. Just wasted a bullet there. What is that noise? I know you guys hear that. Sn oh my god, it's the frog thing! It's the frog thing! Run! What did he do? He ran into the wall? Okay, he, he runs into the wall. So he's kind of he's kind of dumb. I need this token, though. Alright, whatever. He just runs into the wall, then... Hey, I mean, what can I do about it, right? He's a dumb frog. Alright, let's get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out! Good. I mean, so you really don't have to do much with him. He seems easy enough. He's just going to run into the what wall. What is that? Okay. We're back upstairs. Okay. No, no. We need to go. I think we need to go back into that room. We got to avoid the frog, which could be. I don't know where he's at. Okay. He's over there. He's over there. He's going to run into the wall, right? Okay. <laughs> that guy is. He's something else. We're going to go back through here because we kind of just. Went right past where I think we should have gone, which was up here. Nope. I still can't. Bro, this, th it's crazy. It's crazy how much. Okay. Uh. Hold on. Hold on. There we go. Good use of the shotgun there. Okay. <laughs> Let's go back in here because I think we hey, could have went. I'm Norman. Oh no, really Norman's Norman gone. Guy. He was right here. I just kind of uh, show up to be a friendly face in the background. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, sometimes we're all friendly. How, here. Norman? How? <laughs> okay, so we can go TV studio or music studio, but but the music studio is blocked off. Let's go to the TV studio then. And we're looking for something to put in that box. Okay, more shotgun shells. Okay, we came in through that door, right? So, we'll go through here. Okay. Oh, boy. Alright, what do we got here? The audience cheers. Exciting music plays. Lights flash around the stage. Ricky wearing a bow tie. It's the eating game. Here's our star, Goblet. Goblet enters and takes her place at her podium. On stage, a number of reluctant dishes lie atop number, numbered podiums. Goblet, today's game is which dish? Why do I feel like I'm about to get attacked? Alright, we gotta do something with the dishes I'm taking from that. Alright, here we go. Go in here. Oh, I need that. 
Easy. Right. Aim piece. Oh, that might be what I need. Bro, I need to I need to stash some of this stuff. Let's see. What do we not really need anymore? Or maybe we go in here. We'll get on the other side. And swallow again. Now you have two hands. I can't get in through here either. That's how numbers work. Oh, oh, oh. Let's just make sure we're not missing anything don't, in here. Don't forget to hack your hands back up. I mean, I yeah, feel like I should. There's uh, quite around here. Oh, these the oh, eating. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then to get in there, we probably got to go through that door. I'm pretty good. I can't, I can't get, I can't get into them. I'm going to take this game piece. I think we're going to need it. So in order to take it, we're going to have to drop something that costs one. When you go to the park, bring some food and wild animals. For birds, you can bring sunflower seeds. I think I think I have an idea. You can bring peanuts. I'm just gonna shoot Norman here and tie him up. Also, oh, it's coming from above me. Yeah, I'm gonna use this to shoot Norman out here, and then we'll tie him up because we're gonna have to come back to this area anyways. So if where's you can Norman? Draw, you can do all sorts of things. Grab your pencil and let's go on an adventure. Whoa, 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 there we whoa. go. So that takes care of that. And that, that should be two spaces there. We'll take the game piece because I know we're going to need it. It's pretty random that that Gordon would look at it and not like, w why would we look at it? And it, it would tell us to take it unless we're going to need okay, it. Uh, it could uh, go in that, that safe. Or, or, or All right. Or, we got or, the game or, piece. Okay. Uh, we've got a this is good. Dang it. And I wish this guy would just kick the door down and shoot it down, man. All right. And we've got a little game piece here now. I'm trying to think of other things that we've left kind of in in limbo that we can still use. And this area is off limits, and it literally is off limits. And Norman's laughing or crying draw, in the can do stairs. All sorts of things. Grab your pencil and let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We, we're on a move here. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, it's time for you, buddy. I would tie you up if I could, but I can't. These guys are so funny to me. Okay, there they go. We'll come back through here. Dude, I wish I knew what I was doing. There hasn't been anything that's asked for like a game piece. Unless... Oh wait, here we go. Looks like fun. Maybe I'll give it a shot. Okay. Press the bell to start. When it's your turn, either draw a card or play a card to move that many spaces. First to the end wins. Special spaces. If you land on Norman, draw a card. Junebug is wild. Oh, that's her name, Junebug. If you start your turn on Junebug, immediately play the top of the cards of the deck. Poor Leonard is slow. If you're on Leonard, you can only play one. Uh-oh, if you land on Goblet, you lose. Press the bell to start. When's your turn? Oh, okay. This tells you the rules again. All right, let's press the bell. I guess let's start. I mean, three, two. Oh, no, we're playing with this guy? Okay, so we want to go... Um, <laughs> we want to go, uh, are these the spaces here? If we go two, we land on Norman and we get to draw a card. So let's do that. Okay. We put a three and he landed on her. And so he has to play the first card on the deck. Draw a card. Wait, why did he get to go again? Uh-oh. If we go three, we go one, two, three. Oh no. And we, we don't want that. So let's go one and then we... We play the first card on the deck. Oh, he landed on Norman. Okay, so if we go three here, one, two, three, that'll bring us there. All right, whatever. Hey, Let's go through. Hey, why'd he smack me? What Guess the? You gotta follow the rules. Why? Hello? What you? Okay. Uh, you draw a card or play a card to move that many spaces. First to the end wins. What did I do wrong? <laughs> what did I? He smacked me. I'm just gonna go two. Just gonna go two. One, two. One, two, three. He has to play whatever comes up at the top of the deck. I can go one, two, three, or I can just go two, which is what I'm gonna do. Save our threes and our ones. Okay. Of course he gets a three. One, two, three. We draw a card. It's a one, of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? We go three again, so I can just pass over this. He goes. God, dude, that's crazy. He has to play a one here. We're gonna draw a card. It's a one. He gets a one. That's that's insanity. 
He has to play the top of the deck, but you know he's not gonna... You know what's gonna end up happening here, right? He gets a three! I this won. is rare! Oh my god. Literally, as long as he doesn't somehow cheat, I win. Ah! Ha! I did it! Now what? Give me that key! Oh my god, we got the key that opens up literally everything. Oh my gosh, we finally got the diamond key. Okay. What do we need over here? What is this? What is this? One, two, three, four. Interesting. What is... Oh, that's the room that... Ah, okay. What does this say? Um, Out of touch, reality, two out of five stars. Oh, it's saying that the show sucks. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, Okay. One, two, three, four. We got to find some type of code. And then... All right. Okay. So we know we need to find an order of operation. Let me see how this thing works, though. Unless... Insert the reel into the projector. Press the corresponding buttons to start the projection. And then it loops... Oh, okay. So if I do it like this, it plays like whatever is... Gotcha. Oh, what's this? There's no room in the toolbox. My God, man. My toolbox is always... Oh, boy. Okay. Um... Unless I reload. There we go. So that should open up. If I have magazines here, wouldn't this be inside of the... And what is this? A grenade. Okay. I need an empty four slot. So I'll move this. That should be four right there, right? Got it. Okay. Insert the reel. There we go. What does this do? Inspect. There's the reel. And then what do we got over here? I need another reel or something? Oh, okay. So I need one more reel. Okay. So we need one more reel, and then we need to figure out whatever the heck the code is. That's not too bad. The mail, the mail comes every day. Take this out. Right I look now. out the oh, window, thank God. waiting for the moment it appears, and then when it does, I rush outside to see what I okay, got. Okay. Okay. Of paper. So Sometimes let's. No what we need to figure out what other doors that I'm missing that are tr diamond. All right, let's see if this is the door that we're looking for because I don't really see any other doors. Um, oh, wait. I could put the masks on them. Oh, my God. Okay. That guy's missing an eye. What does this say? Our friends feel a lot of feelings. Junebug had a good day. Norman had a bad day. Liliana found a big mouse. George got cut off in traffic. Okay, so I got a few masks here. So you had a... Wait, Norman had a bad day. So we got to replace that with a... Uh, Bad day. Um, Junebug had a good day. So she gets the yellow mask. Um, Liliana found a big mouse and George got cut off in traffic. So what's the last mask? Oh, she found a mouse. That's probably her face. And then let's go see if we could find an angry one. I think that's the one that would be missing is an angry face. Oh, shotgun shells. We'll take that. I need some magazines again, though. Oh, more saving. Okay, um... Let's... We don't need to heal, so we'll save. There we go. Perfect. And let's see if we could find this. Oh, nope. That's locked. All right, guys. I actually think we're going to wrap up this episode here. Now, if you do want to see some more of this, do me a huge favor, guys. Stop what you're doing. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button as well. And make sure you tune in to episode number two. Anyways, guys, till next time. Peace out!